Hello again everyone, welcome back to my channel. So first of all, I want to apologize if I look like this. It's because I just woke up and then fixed my hair. Unfortunately, I can't put a little bit of makeup on to make myself more look, uh, look more decent. And it's because um, we're getting facials today. So I was recently tagged by my sweet friend um, Snape HBP. And this is the behind the scenes YouTuber tag. Um, if I look down and it's because I'm reading the questions. So yeah, let's just get started. What camera do you use? Um, I 90% of the time or maybe 99% of the time I'm using my phone. It's just easier for me that way. But if I want a better view, like on my Cartier um, review, like Cartier bracelet review, then I used my Canon G7X, which is like a compact DSLR, I guess. That's what it, the category of it is. And it does have this self, um, you know, it would be nice to start filming on this, um, but editing on my iMac or my MacBook sorry takes forever because it is my MacBook is um, I think about five years old now and we know that Apple is fond of giving an expert expiry date on their devices I guess it sucks but so like my MacBook isn't as efficient and then who films for you myself um, I do have this tripod for when I used to do the just my hands unboxing and then now I'm using a desktop tripod um, where my phone is sitting currently it's one of those where you could um, hang it on the tree and stuff like that and then what editing system do you use I use iMovie on my phone and the reason why, that's where I first learned to do it. Um, and I'm so used to how to edit on the phone. I don't really edit it as much, but I usually add like the title and then cut some parts where, like let's say I'm opening a box or something, then I cut that part off just to make it a little bit shorter um, than the original video. And then I learned doing it on the phone first, so that's why it's easiest for me, and that's why I just have to record on my phone. And then I tried doing it on my MacBook, and like I said, my MacBook is not efficient at all, so it took forever, and uploading was the worst. Um, it took like a day to upload or something. Um, do you use artificial or natural lighting? I have a window in front of me. Um, in my office desk at home but if I'll show you if I open it like this this is how it looks when I open it so there's streak of lights light coming in it's definitely brighter but also sometimes I find that my face becomes really um, glary from the light if that makes sense so I just kind of um, peek it open just a little bit um, so I guess natural lighting um, what's the top item on your filming wish list? I do, I have been looking into getting, you um, like the stand-up light for filming. Um, if you watched, um, Super Coco Nova's video of this, Lorelai's video of this, then, um, something like that. I was, I've been looking into it, but, you know, I was I sit on my desk and it's a window right in front of me so there's no really space in front of me to do to put that so if I do get it I would have to sit on my couch which is right there and have the light here where I'm sitting and yeah but I'm not sure if I'm gonna get that anytime soon um, I think my windows good enough for now and then what is your favorite day of the week to film most of my videos I film in the morning when my kids are still asleep so and then right before work so I would wake up a little bit earlier than usual to film 
and I kind of like that. It's okay. Um, it also gives me a reason to get out of bed, um, you know, rather than just laying there and waiting for time to pass. So, um, do you plan your videos? If so, how? No, not really. If I'm using a bag, I'm just like, oh, I want to mention that when I film a video, but sometimes I forget, and then. So now I actually kind of have to write it down somewhere. I do have an agenda and I have not written, written anything on it yet um, because it starts in July. But maybe then I could do more um, written video ideas for you guys. And if you have any requests, please leave them down below. Maybe a little Q&A, but I was thinking like would I even get any questions it doesn't have to be about personal shopping like my first um, Q&A video and then how long does it take for you oh how long does it take you to film the average video um, it depends on how long the video actually goes I usually only do two takes and the first take is when when I kind of mess up in the beginning so I just start over again and then after which I just kind of if I make a mistake in the middle of the video or towards the end then I just cut that part off and then you know start from the line that's where that's what I mostly do when I edit and then how many hours do you spend editing the average video not that long and it's because I just cut off the parts where I know I made a mistake like I said something wrong, like a word wrong or something, then I just cut it off. What type of video to film? Oh, favorite type of video to film? Definitely unboxings, and this is, um, you know, why I started my channel. And I also love doing reviews now, so if you want me to review any of my handbags from watching my handbag collection, um, let me know, and I'll also do that because I actually enjoy giving my pros and cons for the bags that I have and um, what else oh yeah I think that's it <laughs> um, do people at your work slash school know about your channel um, not that you know I don't think so I I was just like if they find me then you know I'll tell them or if they ask me about it I'll tell them but um, no, <laughs> um, they, I guess they don't really watch these types of videos, so I'm good for now. <laughs> what is your process of thinking of a video idea? Um, nothing special, just, you know, if I get something new, then of course an unboxing. Um, and then if I want to do a review, then I'll try to remember what I liked and disliked about the bag, like I mentioned. And then, do you fall, film, I mean, do you feel awkward filming around other people? Yes. Um, that's why I actually lock myself into your office because even if, like, my husband walks in, I kind of feel awkward, um, you know, doing this. So, hopefully not in the future. And I do kind of, in public, oh wait, yeah. Um, well, I kind of want to do like a vlog soon, maybe one of our little um, vacation slash getaways, you know. Um, it's just one of the ideas that I have, but I have not set on it, <clears throat> so we'll see. Do you have a YouTube friend? <clears throat> I'm sorry. Do you have a YouTube friend that you like to plan videos with? Um, like I mentioned, I don't, none of my... You, you know, co-workers or friends really know about my channel. So if they find me, then maybe they want to plan videos with me. But um, for now, none. Um, what is your subscriber goal by the end of the year? Um, does that mean how many subscribers I have by the end of the year? If so, then I don't really have a preference. I am... Um, I am now... It over 600 subscribers so thank you so much for subscribing I didn't really imagine that I would get that many subscribers you know um, starting the channel it was kind of slow and then it kind of picked up to when I started um, when did it pick up maybe when 
I did more the personal shopping q and I think that's when it picked up, I think. Or what is your subscriber goal? But that's what it means, right? How many subscribers I want by the end of the year. So, no number. Just anyone who subscribes. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And, yeah. Um, who do you want to tag to do... Oh. Who do you tag to do this tag next? Um, seeing as most of my subscriptions... Yeah, has done this. I'll just add their names down below. I'll check their um, videos if they have done it. But if not, then I'll tag them. So yeah, for um, yeah. Lastly, I want to thank you again. Um, to say thank you again to Sam um, for tagging me. I really kind of like doing these tag videos. Um, this is my first official tag video. I don't know if for the what's in my bag tag people actually had to tag you but yeah and then final message is that I want you guys to leave me questions down below if you have any regarding um, handbags or any anything really if um, I get enough questions and maybe I could do a Q&A before my packages get here next week then I'll do like unboxings so um yeah, or any video requests. Um, would really love to do video requests because I know that I'm helping someone in a way. So, and then what else? Yeah, I think that's it for this video. Um, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.